Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video guys to any of you having a Hyundai Sonata. If you guys have a Hyundai Sonata and you want to see how to test throttle position sensor, also known as the throttle accelerator pedal, stay with us, we will explain guys how to do that. Now you may have multiple, multiple throttle position sensors. One of them is the throttle acceleration pedal and when you press your gas pedal, okay, it tells the engine computer how much gas you press guys, how much uh, the car needs to go. Then you have another one that's part of the throttle body. In today's video we'll explain about the pedal but we'll cover a little bit about the other one as well so make sure to stand till the end. Now uh, uh, let's go ahead explain what we need to do okay what we'll be using and all that stuff. So this should actually work on Hyundai Sonata generation from year 2010 all the way to year 2015 guys. Also uh, let me introduce you quick to the channel. If you guys uh, need to buy any parts, tools, anything like that, we'll share the links in the description of the video below and you can see where we get all that from for a really good price and quick shipping as well. Another thing, every single car we get at the garage we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos and specifically guys on this Hyundai Sonata we'll have more than 300 videos, mechanical videos videos that will be uploaded on the channel you're watching right now and we'll have more than 200 electrical videos about diagnostics fixing electrical components and that will be posted on our second channel electrical car repair live check it out guys everything okay will be shared so we can guys save you as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel and like the video Specifically guys, this is a 2013 Hyundai Sonata that we'll be working on. This is the computer that we'll be using. This is one of the best scanners guys, okay, that you can find for the price. We'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get it guys. It's amazing. We simply recommend it guys uh, because we purchased it ourselves. It's not a sponsored video, but you can work on any car you can think of almost guys. Okay, check it out. You can even work on Ferraris, Maybachs. Lamborghinis guys it's uh, super super cool too and uh, it covers the Asian vehicles as well such as uh, Hyundai okay where it's Hyundai Kia uh, multiple vehicles guys so now we have the throttle body removed okay but today we'll show you how to test the throttle pedal mainly guys and we'll explain about the throttle body okay how uh, it's affected by the throttle pedal so we need to come inside the vehicle okay let me just turn that light on so we can see find under the steering wheel okay you need to find where your obd connector is guys okay right there i'm trying to find the connector for that thing now okay perfect plug it in the computer okay is plugged in now we hear an audible beep that's great let's explain okay what else we need to do okay let me see if i just got the camera through the hoop here okay you probably just got sick from all the motion motion happening here but i'm trying to get in this vehicle guys so now next scene we need to turn the ignition switch on all the way on and that's the throttle pedal okay right here let's explain okay what we'll be doing now we come right here okay this is the computer we click vin auto detect okay perfect it's working on it now it's going to read the vin number we confirm okay and it will tell you the battery voltage make sure that you have good battery voltage i recommend to be over 12.5 even put the car on a charger because when you do diagnostics it tends to drop pretty quick so 2012 model but it's actually 2013 year it's made in 2012 gdi 2.4 engine doesn't matter which engine you have we select control unit auto scan is going to scan the whole system we select engine next what you need to do live data and that's all the parameters that you can see this computer lets you work on every computer in your car you can read delete codes and see live data so now let's go ahead scroll down you can see all the temperatures everything about your engine practically guys immobilizers building no this one doesn't have immobilizer so ignition switch is on main relay let's see where it is come on there are so many things that you can see okay battery temperature reference water temperature ignition so it should be any minute right here somewhere fuel adaptation 
Total position, guys. Okay, right here. Total position, okay, is right here. This is the total body, guys. The accelerator pedal position, it's in percentage, 0%, or you can see the voltage as well. Now, let's go ahead, okay, and explain what's going to happen now. I'm going to press that pedal. Okay, and the moment I press it, you're going to see the thing will change. Check it out now. It goes to 99.6% when pressed all the way down. I'll press about halfway, 51%. Two thirds, about 73%. Now, check it out, all the way, 96%. So that's a good working pedal guys, you can see how it changes. So, definitely guys, that's a working pedal, with no problems. Now, I'm going to go outside, okay, and I'm going to try to pass the computer, okay, one second. So, okay, let's see if I can do that. We'll pass the computer this way, okay, that's it, that's good. And I'll come like that, and you can even test your throttle ball, check it out now. We have it connected to the, okay, we'll connect it to the, uh, we have it connected to the wiring harness, perfect. This is the throttle body. The throttle body, it says that it's uh, at five point, okay, 5.2, 5.3 degrees angle, 5.2, 5.3, and if we move it by hand now, okay, check it out now, all the way, that's about 90 degrees, check it out, it's going to go, okay, to, Okay, right there, 88.7. Now, if you go about 45 degrees, okay, a little bit more, you can see it moves, guys. So, you can definitely see if your throttle body is working, guys. So, you can test everything with that computer. You get the idea, guys? We, everything's good here, most likely. Okay, we don't have any problems. It could be just a dirty throttle body that triggered our lights. And we'll have a special video that explains how to clean it on our channel, how to clean throttle body on Hyundai Sonata. Hopefully guys the video will be helpful, thank you for watching and see you next time.